I should, right, your PS2 games, I'm going to just put there, alright? Okay. Uh. <laughs> right, see you in a minute. Alright. 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 Uh, console games. Um, uh, PlayStation, Xbox. No, I've seen all the PC ones, yeah. 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 Alright, cheers guys. No worries. Have Xbox. Whole for a fiver. All of them for fiver. <laughs> Morning. Cheers, mate. Uh, yeah, I will. Cheers, mate. Yeah, two sets. You one, but you probably lose it. Excuse me, mate. Boxes of uh, games. There are two boxes of games you've got down there. How much can you do for both boxes? I've got a list of So it does work, eh? Yeah, it does work. Alright, oh, I know, mate. Keep it off. I know, mate. Oh, it's You have to take it. 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 You have Go for it. You alright if I leave me yeah, no for a minute? Brilliant. Cheers, mate.
So here we are, we are now back in the games room and what an absolutely cracking boot fair that was. Uh, as you can see, sort of, <laughs> it, is, uh, it has been extremely hot out there today. Um, I am sort of glowing red, so sort of obviously being ginger, we are allergic to the sun. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna sort of get on with it. But as you have seen from the video, we got some absolutely cracking finds and we're going to get straight into it with the free Xboxes that we picked up. So we've got one of the standard Xboxes. Um, I've, to be quite honest, I paid a fiver for all three of these. Um, and looking at the top of that, I'm just probably in that bit there. Don't know if you can see it, but it looks like there's some rust in there. So I am under the, I'm going under the impression when I bought them, it's under the impression that all of them have, have got red ring of death. Um, so this one, obviously I haven't got a charger for this one and the next one. Um, I have got one on order and yeah, I'm just waiting to sort of wait until that arrives. That should arrive within the next sort of day or so. So what I will do is I'll put a sort of, a little comment sort of down below when we get the second one up as to sort of whether they both work or not. Um, this one is the original version, so there's no HDMI on this one. So yeah, if it works, it will be getting added to the collection. Um, none of them have come with hard drives. So I am gonna be buying the hard drives for sort of all of these. Then the next one we've got is, once again, it is, hasn't got the HDMI but it does have a custom front plate. Um, now I've done a bit of research and the front plate is from Mad Cats. Um, so it's not a, a re official sort of Microsoft cover, but I am gonna try it and sort of either track down a whole, I'm gonna probably have to track down a whole new cover, but I do wanna sort of try and get it so that I've got the, the correct sort of plate in there. Um, so yeah, as I say, those two haven't been tested yet. Um, I haven't got the, the actual power brick for them, but the next one, which is this one, has been tested. Um, I, uh, the power brick for this arrived this morning, um, so I actually tested it before doing this video, and it works. So the CD drive is broken on it, but other than that, it works. It powers on, goes right the way through to the Xbox dashboard. So yeah, absolutely over the moon with this. Once again, I'm gonna to have to try and sort of track down a replacement cover for the memory card slot. But yeah, this one is gonna get a, re, uh, a refurb. So um, there will be a repair video coming up sort of on this one and those ones, if they don't work. As I say, I'm not too sure on them yet because I haven't got the covers. I haven't got the power brick. Then the next thing that I bought was two absolutely ginormous boxes of games. So we've got PlayStation, we've got Xbox, 360, PlayStation 2, the whole shebang. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch the camera around um, I'm going to sort of aim it down at my desk so that we can actually go through the whole box together. I have, I've had a brief look through, um, but there's been no, I couldn't actually tell you how many doubles, how many one, how many originals we've got, I don't know. So let me just switch the camera around and then we can have a look through these boxes together. So here we are, here is the first of the two boxes um, and both of the boxes I paid five pounds, uh, paid 30 pounds for, sorry. Uh, not five pounds, 30 pounds. But yeah, there is an absolute truckload of games. So let's get started straight off the bat. Once again, there's not gonna be any sort of gameplay footage on this. I'm just gonna sort of rattle through the games as quickly as we can. So first off, we've got My Pet Dolphin on the DS, but when you look inside, 
it's got Dolphin Island cartridge so yeah don't think that that's the right case for that game but even still I will have a look then we've got a PS1 game we've got who wants to be a millionaire um, we have already got this I believe yep so that is another double well that is a double should we say then we've got Mission Impossible on the PlayStation in an Area 51 case so that's a shame I'd have liked to have got Area 51 but not too sure on Mission Impossible never played it so maybe one that's worth a look and then we're going to get into so looking at this box it's going to be predominantly Xbox 360 but there are a sort of couple of PlayStation 2 and a couple of PlayStation a uh, couple of original Xbox in here as well so we've got Tom Clancy's End War uh, the case is completely mashed but it does have the disc in the manual Yep, once again, thing is, as I've said before, I'm not massively concerned about the the discs because we do have the I can never remember what it's called, but the disc refurb uh, setup. So Xbox Live Arcade companion disc. This has actually been one that I've been sort of trying to get hold of for a while. I've been seeing it in the the charity shops. We've then got a original Xbox demo disc. We've got Forza Horizon 3, which we've already got. Dead Space 2, which was what really sort of attracted me uh, to these boxes. I uh, haven't got any of the Dead Space yet, I don't think. We've got Gears of War. This is actually a bundle copy, so I don't have a bundle copy of Gears of War, just the standard retail. We've got Call of Duty Ghosts and FIFA 15. Uh, once again, with the Call of Duty, yes, we have got Ghosts. And I believe we've got FIFA 15, yep. So we've got all, we've actually got, I'm just looking now, we've got all of the FIFAs from 10 to 15. So there you go, we've got FIFA 13, which we've already got. Uh, Tom Clancy's Hawks, which I think we've got, but I'm not too sure. FIFA 14, Rainbow Six Free. We've got FIFA 09, which is not one that we've got yet. We've got Guitar Hero World Tour. Uh, Headhunter on the PS2, which I think we've got. Uh, da, 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 da. No, we haven't. That's obviously a uh, original Xbox game that we've got. So we've got FIFA 07. Uh, I'm not too up on sort of what FIFA games we've got on the on the PS2. We've got Open Season. And we've got Connect Sports, which we've definitely got. We've got World Snooker Championship 2007 on the PS2. Transformers Revenge of the Fallen on the 360. Uh, Stuntman on the PS2. It's the Platinum Edition. I think we've got the Black Label for that one. Uh, yes, we've got the Black Label, but we haven't got the Platinum. We've got International Snooker Championship on the PS2. Uh, World Rally Championship on the PS2. I think we have got that one. Hitman 2, we've definitely got that. Uh, Modern Warfare 4, uh, sorry, Call of Duty Modern Warfare on the 360. Uh, no, we haven't. We've got Modern Warfare 2, but we haven't got the, f uh, the first one. Halo 3, we've got that one. And this looks like a bundled copy. Yeah, a bundled copy of Prince of Persia Sands of Time. Uh, so we haven't got this one. We haven't got a bundled copy. We've just got the normal retail version. Then we've got Conflict Zone Modern War Strategies, which I think we have got on the PS2. Uh, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Uh, no, that's going to be a new one. FIFA 07 on the 360. Uh, Project Gotham Racing on the original Xbox as a classic. Uh, I think we have got that one. Uh, Tiger Woods PGA Tour 2003. Uh, Spy Hunter on the PS2. Not too sure about that one. 
We've then got a very battered copy of FIFA 12, uh, but we luckily have already got that. Um, and then we've got a copy of Prototype 2 in the cardboard sleeve as well. So yeah, we definitely haven't got that one, which is good. And then we've got uh, Black Ops on the 360, which just looking down, we have got that one. And Test Drive Ultimate on the 360. Once again, another one that we haven't got. Very nice. Then FIFA 13 again on the 360. Uh, Ghost Recon Island Thunder on the original Xbox. Yes, we've got that one. We've got another original Xbox demo disc. We've got Modern Warfare 3 on the 360, which we haven't got. Uh, we've got Wii Play, which we have got. Conflict Desert Storm 2. Uh, we have got that one, but it is a platinum. So we haven't got the black label on that one. We've got World Tour on the 360. I think that's the second one we've got in here. We've got Halo Reach, which is another duplicate. We've got what looks like a slightly better condition of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4, uh, Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare on the 360. We've got Assassin's Creed 3, which we have got. Uh, Rainbow Six Vegas 2. We've got Ghost Recon Advanced Warfighter in the 360 on the Classics. And then we've got FIFA 10 as well. So, yeah, that is going to be the first box. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get them all sort of put away. Um, and then I will just switch over. And we'll go through the, the second box. But, yeah, some really good titles in that one. So here we are, here is the second box. So yeah, another load of games. So I'm gonna start, we'll start with this one. So we've got Driver on the PS1, which we have already got, but obviously we don't have the cover or the manual for that. Then we've got uh, Michael Owens, uh, World League Soccer 99. That is just the disc and the manual. Uh, we haven't got either of the covers, but we do have a replacement top for the case. And then we've got uh, 2010 FIFA World Cup South Africa uh, on the PSP, but it has Midnight Club LA Remix in it. Very nice. I may have to try and track down the covers for that then. Uh, we've got uh, Nintendogs, so just cartridge only, but we do have a DS case, which is always handy to have. We've then got Play the Games. So it has Theme Park World, the FA Premier League Stars, Thief Dark Project, Dark Project, sorry, um, and Gangsters. So this is a, a PC title. But when we open it up, we've got Totally Twisted. Uh, I think these are sort of old screensavers. We've then got the FA Premier League Stars disc. Gangsters and Theme Park World. So we are missing Thief the Dark Project. But yeah, a nice one there. Then we've got another PSP game, uh, Championship Manager. Oh, and there's a couple in there. So we've got 300 March to Glory, and then we've also got FIFA 08. We haven't got the Championship Manager uh, UMD in there. And then we go through sort of the discs only, disc only's. 
So we've got a Xbox 360 magazine, uh, original Xbox, um, 4x4 Evo 2, PC version of Tomb Raider 2, uh, 360 version of Modern Warfare 4, uh, sorry, Modern Warfare Call of Duty 4, I'll get there eventually on that. Uh, Wings of War, Max Payne on the original Xbox. Uh, Star Trek Shattered Universe on the original Xbox. Uh, State of Emergency on the original Xbox. And Unreal Championship Classics Edition on the original Xbox. So, very nice there. Now, we will dig into the, the second box. So, looking through it. Um, once again, it's looking more sort of Xbox centric, but let's have a look through. So straight off the bat, we've got Wii Fit Plus, uh, which is the one we've got. Uh, juiced on the original Xbox, we have got uh, Colin McRae Rally 04. Uh, not too sure on that, it's all hidden. Uh, SingStar Pop World on the PS2. Uh, Splinter Cell Chaos Theory. Oh, I've got a feeling we have got that. I will search through all these at the end and sort of double check. Uh, SingStar Party on the PS2. Uh, Medal of Honor Frontline. I'm 99% sure that we've got that. Uh, Top Spin, so that's Tennis Game on the original Xbox. We've got Shrek 2 DVD. Oh. Okay, so someone has put the Shrek 2 uh, Xbox game into a Shrek 2 DVD case. So, yep, that's an interesting one. Then we've got Gran Turismo um, Concept uh, Tokyo 2 Geneva. Uh, we have got that one. Next up, we've got Pure on the 360. I don't know if we've got the standard edition. I think we've got the dual pack on that. We've then got Ghost Recon 2 on the original Xbox. Dead Island on the 360, which we have got. Medal of Honor limited edition on the 360. We've got Halo 3 on the 360. Uh, Dukes of Hazard: The Return of the General Lee on the PS2. That's definitely a new one. We've got Conflict Global Storm. That's another new one. And Splinter Cell Classics Edition on the original Xbox. And we finish off with Dark Sector on the PS3, uh, which we have got. And then we've got... So this was one that sort of, uh, when I sort of breezed through it, I saw. So this is Sega GT 2002, but also Jet Set Radio Future. Um, it's got the manual, um, it just hasn't unfortunately got the cover. So that's a real shame because they are, that is a game that we haven't got. Uh, we've got Silent Scope 2 on the PS2. No, just Silent Scope, sorry, on the PS2. We've then got Buffy the Vampire Slayer, uh, Chaos, Chaos Bleeds on the original Xbox. Uh, I'm not sure. I know we've got a Buffy game on the Xbox. I'm not sure whether that's the same one. We've got PDC World Champion Darts 2008 on the Wii. Got Ghost Recon 2 Summit Strike on the X, original Xbox. We've got that one. Harry Potter Goblet of Fire on the PS2. Not too sure on that one. Yes, we have got that one. Uh, we've got Pacific War, uh, Pacific Warriors 2 Dogfight on the PS2. We've got Elder Scrolls uh, Skyrim on the 360. I'm not sure if we've got that one, actually. We've then got uh, Gran Turismo 3 A-Spec Platinum Edition on the PS2. I think we have got that. I think we got that in the last big lot that we got. Uh, we've then got the Classics Edition of LEGO Star Wars on the original Xbox and the blacktop label of Medal of Honor Frontline on the PS2. So we've got that one, I know that. Then we've got Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon on the Xbox. Do you know what? I'm not sure if we've got that one. Um, I know we've got so many of them now, but I'm not too sure. 
We've got Skylanders uh, Trap Team on the Wii. We've got Medal of Honor Classics Edition, uh, Medal of Honor Frontline Classics Edition on the original Xbox. Medal of Honor Rising Sun on the Xbox. Uh, another Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. This one looks in slightly better condition, but actually when we look inside, we see we've actually got the Black Ops disc. So I've got the feeling that there's gonna be some discs that are all over the shot here. We've got Gun on the Xbox, we've got that. We've got Halo 2 on the Xbox, we've got that. Uh, Halo 3 and Streets of LA, uh, True Crime Streets of LA, sorry, uh, on the original Xbox, so we've got all of them. Then we've got The Incredibles on the PS2, I think we have got that one now as well. Colin McRae Rally 3 on the PS2. Uh, 007 Quantum of Solace, uh, not sure on that one. We've got Rugby 2004 on the PS2. Yeah, it's disc only. Uh, we've got Smackdown, Here Comes the Pain, uh, Platinum Edition on the PS2, that's a new one, but it has got a bit of a broken case at the bottom there. We've got Assassin's Creed 2 on the 360, which we have got, yep. Yeah. Uh, Pro Evolution Soccer 4 on the PS2, uh, FIFA 11 on the Wii, which is another new one. And then, uh, I'll tell you what, I'm going to do these two first because we've got FIFA 19 on the PS4 and it is complete. So we have already got FIFA 19 on the PS4, but yeah, amazing to actually get a PS4 game in with this as well. We've got Brothers of Arms, Earned in Blood on the original Xbox. And then a couple more. Disney Infinity uh, 2.0 on the 360. We've got Lips on the 360. Charlie's Angels on the PS2. So I don't think I've got this one. I have, but it doesn't look to be in as good condition. Uh, so yeah, I'll probably be swapping over for that one. We've got Far Cry 3 on the 360. Uh, Medal of Honor Rising Sun on the PS2, we have got that one. Uh, Connectimals, we haven't got this one actually. Uh, so the case is a bit battered up. So I'm gonna have to try and find the purple case or a purple case replacement for that. Uh, we've got Club Penguin uh, Game Day on the Wii. Oh, there we go, lucky catch. Case is broken, but I think I have got a spare Wii case sort of kicking around. So I can swap that out. And then two more. We've got Imagine Teacher's School Trip on the DS. Yeah, that's box complete. And the final one is Brain Training on the DS. That is the original version. And once again, box complete. So that is gonna be it for, for the massive collection. So um, we paid five pounds for the, for the free Xboxes. We know that one of them's working and then we paid 30 pounds for sort of all these two big boxes of games. Um, I think, so what's that? That's 35 pounds all day long. We were probably, we're probably looking upper upper hundreds to sort of lower 200s i think for sort of all of this so once again another absolutely amazing day um, and the boot fairs are sort of really paying off with regards to sort of getting the games um, i i will admit i am really really enjoying sort of going around the boot fairs looking for sort of all the video game stuff so i really hope you're all enjoying these videos as well um, because yeah, we're, we're getting so many sort of great games to add to the collection. So if you think just in this box, these, this pile is all gonna be brand new. Um, actually, I think I've put, yeah, so it's even more. So yeah, absolutely brilliant. So that is gonna be the end of today's video. Um, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like down below. Really sort of helps me sort of boost the channel in the YouTube al algorithm. Um, also, if you're not already, subscribe to the channel. I do release sort of charity shop and or boot fair videos every Friday. So um, yeah, if you're enjoying this, I'm also doing standard hunts 
on a Wednesday. Um, and at the moment, at the time of filming this, that is all I'm doing. But I know that there are plans to sort of bring back the repair videos on a Monday. So yeah, stay tuned for that. And yeah, with that said, thank you so, so much for watching today. I really hope you enjoyed the video and I look forward to seeing you on the next one. All right, bye.